Hi everyone, welcome back to the Only Shade Drops channel. Yesterday was Super Saturday, or shall I say, mini Super Saturday compared to the previous one. We've had one new Eurovision entry and it's Lithuania. Monika Linkuite is coming back to Eurovision 8 years after this time which she sang with Vaidas Bomas in 2015, they made the grand final with that song this time she's back with the song Stay and I might say I am pleased by the choice of Lithuania if you watched my ranking video and all you will know that Monika with my second of this Pabandom is now your final and I think of the national final overall and also one thing is yesterday there were some changes to the song it was different compared to in the hits and the semi-final they, they changed the part, the part just after the chorus you get that just and all right after that part we had uh, the part that was there was my heart is beating finally that was it but now we got something different we get all the backing vocalists coming on stage and singing with them two words in Lithuanian again and again I think it was I don't know if my pronunciation will be well Chuta tuto, something like that and I think this actually brought something quite unique there about this song. It brought, it also brought, I feel, some gospelish vibes. And I think overall this song is really great. I love it. Monica is an amazing singer. We already knew that, but really, she did well. I know there is a bit of controversy in the fact the juries were the tiebreaker in case of a win. I agree. I think the televote should be the one to be th to choose in case of a tiebreaker. But yeah, I, I mean, I didn't like Rotambu's song, and I love Monica Linkuita's song. So it's a bit like North Macedonia last year. There's a part of me which says, nah, this isn't fair and all. <laughs> but the other part of me is like, oh well, right, just for this time, because the song is better. <laughs> but yeah, I think this is a great song. I think Lithuania has quite some good chances to qualify. They will for sure get the United Kingdom 12 based on the diaspora and all, but then it will except that we'll see by the quality of this song i think it's pretty safe it's more of a jury song yeah but i can see it getting some decent televote in the semi-final around 8th and 11th place in the semi-final i think so yeah it's not a safe qualifier but i think it has some good chances to make it uh, in the final it could do okay with the juries maybe a left side of scoreboard with juries but then yeah, a bit tanked by the televote still would get around 18 ish 17 ish result i think if it qualifies to the final so i think it's quite a good choice and my personal rating of the song now uh i don't think there's any doubt i'm going to give this a 10 out of 10 this is already a pretty strong year for me I give already 6 10 out of 10 out of 10s last year was better but then yeah I, I last year was probably my favorite Eurovision no behind 2015 but yeah so I won't really compare it to last year so yeah Lithuania Monica and Kite will stay 10 out of 10 best of luck Monica I hope you will do well and uh, if you like this video, put a like, don't forget to subscribe and join our Discord channel. Thanks for watching, link of Discord channel is in description below. See you there, bye bye.